welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video. In today's video, we're going to make a DIY and facial moisturizer. A moisturizer that will help to lift, tighten, and firm in the skin. A moisturizer using natural ingredients. This moisturizer you can use on your face, your neck, and decollete. Now, before I jump in the kitchen to make this moisturizer, take a look at what I have here. This is the Ultra Defense Chichi Beauty Moisturizer. This contains collagen, it contains retinol, vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin E. This will also help to lift, tighten, and firm the skin and reduce wrinkles on fine lines while hydrating the skin. So if you're interested in the Chichi Beauty Ultra Facial Moisturizer, look at the side of the video you can check out right here on YouTube or visit my YouTube store, alexmaxi.com, and you'll see all the Chichi Beauty skincare products. Now that is out of the way, let's get in the kitchen and start making our DIY facial moisturizer, our anti-aging DIY facial moisturizer. So for this recipe, you're gonna need a small bowl and you're also gonna need a saucepan. So the first thing I'm gonna do, I am gonna pour the rice in the blender and I'm using about a quarter cup of white rice. Rice will help to lift, tighten, and firm the skin. It is great to reduce wrinkles and fine lines on the skin. It is also good for smoothing the skin. So I'm gonna use about a quarter cup of rice. I'm gonna pour this in my blender and then I'm gonna blend to a powder. Once this is done, we are gonna reach for the saucepan and any saucepan will do. And we're gonna pour our blended rice into the saucepan. And then we're gonna reach for some water. I'm gonna be using about a cup of water. You can choose to use a little less, depending on your stove top. Now once this is done, I'm gonna place my saucepan on top of the stove and I'm gonna start stirring. So we're gonna stir this until about three minutes until it start to boil up. And once that start to happen, you continue stirring again for another minute or so. And then we are going to take it from the stove top and we're going to strain it. You want to strain this immediately because if you don't do that, the rice is going to absorb all the water. So strain and after it is strained, go ahead and put it aside. Now, once it is cooled, it is now ready to make our facial moisturizer. So here we have the rice water, and this is about three tablespoons of the rice water. And now we are gonna add other ingredients to this. My first ingredient is gonna be aloe vera gel. Aloe vera gel is rich in vitamins and minerals, which will help to hydrate the skin, also help to reduce wrinkles and fine lines on the skin. And aloe vera will help to get rid of hyperpigmentation on the skin, also good for a sunburn skin. So we're gonna use a about a tablespoon of the aloe vera gel, one tablespoon, and we're gonna add this to the rice water. And what we're gonna do, we are gonna totally dissolve the aloe vera gel in the rice water. So mix and mix well. For this recipe, if you have fresh aloe vera gel, you can go ahead and use it. Now totally dissolve the aloe vera gel in the rice water. And once this is done, you're now going to have a serum based consistency. And that is exactly how you want it to be. And now what we're going to do, we are going to add some oils to this. So the first oil I'm going to use is a pomegranate seed oil. This is rich in vitamin C and vitamin E. Help to lighten the skin, help to nourish the skin, help to reduce wrinkles and fine lines on the skin. A good oil to use on your face and also on your body. This is also good for your nails, your knees, your elbows. I'm gonna be using about a, a teaspoon of the pomegranate seed oil, one teaspoon of pomegranate seed oil. Pour this in our mixture. Next oil is gonna be some rosehip seed oil. And rosehip seed oil is rich in essential vitamins, vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin E. It also contains some B vitamins. This is good for wrinkles, good for dark spots and blemishes on the skin, good for lifting, tightening, good as a massage oil on the skin. And it is also good to use as an additional oil to your facial oil blend. I'm gonna be using about a teaspoon 
of the rosehip seed oil and we're pouring this in if you want these oils you can find them at alexmaxi.com home of the chichi beauty skincare products now my next oil is a vitamin e oil and i'm going to use a few drops of the vitamin e oil around about a half a teaspoon that we have our three oils in we are going to slowly blend this into our aloe vera rice water mixture just slowly blend it in and it's going to get even thicker as you continue to mix so go ahead and mix and mix well we're mixing rice water aloe vera gel pomegranate seed oil rose hip seed oil and vitamin e oil we're making a facial moisturizer that is going to help to clear the skin of wrinkles and fine lines hydrate and smooth the skin good for all a skin type and this is also great for tightening and firming the skin from the starch of the rice and now uh, this is done and let me bring it up close for you to see what it looks like it is now a very a serum like consistency and this is what makes this so great because it's just seep right into the skin now we're gonna reach for our storage jar now if you have vegetable glycerin you can go ahead and add a teaspoon to this mixture for a longer shelf life so now let's pour this out and as usual we make the exact amount for these jars so take a look at this this is our rice facial moisturizer made with rice water aloe vera gel pomegranate seed oil rose hip seed oil and a vitamin e oil for hyperpigmentation lifting tightening and firming the skin reducing wrinkles and fine lines while hydrating the skin so to use the moisturizer and you store this in your refrigerator to use the moisturizer you take a few drops of the moisturizer and you apply it on your skin and take a look at this this just melts on the skin and since it is water based it's gonna make the skin just feel and look hydrated so this is it your anti-aging facial moisturizer now if you're looking for a moisturizer that is gonna mimic this one check out my website alexmaxi.com and go ahead and look at our ultra defense moisturizer that is a moisturizer that works similar to this one so either you're gonna make this one or you're gonna up on over to alexmaxi.com and check out our ultra defense moisturizer